Hey everyone, I'm Dom from Wondershare Unicorn Brewer and today we're going to talk about how you can compress a heavy sized file and turn it into a much smaller format. One effective tool for reducing file size and improving storage space is WinRAR. I'm sure that most of you already heard about WinRAR as it is a very popular file compression and archiving program. It offers various features to streamline your file management tasks. WinRAR supports a wide range of compression formats, you can see them on the screen here, and these are not all of them. This versatility makes WinRAR compatible with most file compression standards. But today we'll use the .rar and the .7z format as they are one of the most popular high compression formats. To compress any files, let's open WinRAR. Then navigate to the folder which contains the file you want to compress. Now select the files or folders by holding the Ctrl key and clicking on the individual items or using the Shift key to select a range. Then right click on the selected files and choose add to archive or click on the add button in the toolbar. Here in the general tab of the archive options window, select the file name and the desired compression format from the archive format drop down menu. Here select .rar as it is the native format of WinRAR and this offers the best compression ratio. Now, in the Compression tab, choose Best for the best compression level. It will make your file much smaller, but it takes longer to compress. Now, click Create Solid Archive and Lock Archive. Then lastly, click on OK, which will start the archiving process. Now, WinRAR will create the archive file in the specified location. So WinRAR is a good solution for compressing large sized files. But if you want to compress video or audio, then there is a much better option. To compress video and audio files, we're going to use the Uniconverter. If you don't have the Uniconverter yet, go ahead and download it from videoconverter.wondershare.com and then install it. And then once you have it installed, open it up and you'll find the compressor on the home interface right up here. Now let's see how it works. First of all, drag and drop your video or audio files or both of them into the workspace here. You can choose many files at once so you can compress files in a batch. Okay, now you have two options to set up the compression ratio. One of them is selecting a universal compression ratio that you can do down here. You can either choose a compression percentage preset or you can click on the settings icon here and choose a compression percentage using this slider. So if you select, let's say 60% here, all of your audio and video files will be compressed to 60% of their original file size. The other way is setting up the compression ratio individually. You can click on the settings icon next to each file on your list and set up the compression ratio the same exact way. If you set up the compression ratio individually, you can also see the estimated file size up here in this window. Alternatively, you can set up advanced settings here. You can choose bitrate settings, resolution settings, format settings, but you might not need that. So only change these things if you really know what you're doing. And then after selecting an output folder, click on start all. And now just sit back and relax while the software works its magic. It shouldn't take very long though. Your smaller videos will be ready in no time. Pretty easy, right? Okay, so that is how to highly compress large files on Windows using WinRAR and the Uniconverter. If you found this video useful, leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more. Um, I'm gonna thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.